We have arrived at our destination. I was expecting something the size of a kill ball, maybe, but it's cool, it's cool. You know, this sarcasm is not necessary. Now please act mature while I obtain this object. Oh, God damn it. Motherfucking shit. Got rocks falling on me and shit. What kind of place is this, man? <laughs> That's what you get. Did you even bother reading the small text on top of the orb? God damn it. About to pop a cap in somebody's ass. <clears throat> I mean, uh... Uh, no ma'am, no. I did not read the inscribed text on the rock above me. Could you, uh, please read it for me? <laughs> sure. I don't hear you reading, bitch. I mean, uh, I'm not able to hear you. Can you, uh, speak up, please? All right. Let's see. It says, Vengeance is the essence of the human soul. He who seeks vengeance must, must dig two, two graves. graves. One for thy enemy. And one for thyself. Every human digs their own grave. Thus, when the world is finished digging its own personal cemetery, there will be no hope. The orb. What? My visions keep telling me something about vengeance, my sniper rifle, this temple, and an orb. The same orb that Weird Elite was after? He said it changed the fate of the universe. My name is Josephine Cameron, certified FBI agent. This is my new partner, Logan A. Stone. I'm looking for my son-in-law. Has he passed through here? Was he an elite? No. Then I really could care less. Um, his name is Rev. Oh, yeah. He went inside that temple with his friend Dorito. Dorito? Dorito? The same Dorito that's going out with my ex? I'll fucking kill him! Intruders, do not delete the answer of the issue. I think I just heard an explosion. Then we mustn't take any risks. Um, okay. The shockwave I just released from this hammer can be heard from my elites from thousands of kilometers away. Thus, they will send in an army to save us from any imminent danger. Is that necessary? It's war, bitch. Well, what I meant to say was, better safe than sorry. There they are. Get ready to fight, man. And sir, we promise not to use any Call of Duty references. Good. Now, where is that UAV I ordered? It's sort of one of these situations where we have to sort of pull together as a yeah, family. I would really appreciate it if you can, the attitude. It's okay. like uh, every second week we're doing something. Okay, I understand that. But I know we see them all the time, but there's nothing I can really do. Got any ammo left? Nope, nothing, man. Well, how do we get past them? And what are they arguing about? I don't know, but it sounds funny. Probably one of those married couples who can never get along. Oh god, all you do is nag, nag, nag. I all just I, all oh. I want to know is where you were. I mean, Listen, this is I, not a big deal. I, I just don't came from work. Point. It was, you know, there was nothing At 7.30 going. you just came from work? 7.30? You, you get off at 4.30 and don't try and tell I me any different. I stopped at the liquor store. I had to get a drink. You know what it's like trying to live with you? You need a drink at the end of the day. What the fuck is that supposed to mean? Oh, nag, nag. You, you need a drink to do, to be married up. to me. That's what you're. That's what you're trying to say. Fine, I'll shut up. Yeah, I'll I'll uh, I'll uh, I'll leave you alone with your football game and your you know your Good. pops and chips and you can whack off in front of the TV like you usually oh, do. Oh, so and that's the way it's gonna. Yeah, be. Yeah, that's the way it's gonna be. Yeah. And, I, and I love it when you try and pretend like you're not doing anything under the covers because I can tell. Okay, I can tell. Okay, we'll creep past them while they argue. Ready. Set. Go. We're getting closer. Be careful, Dorito. I had Brutes burritos before we came here. I have to. Hold it in. I have to fart. Hold it in. It's gonna slip. Hold it in. <laughs> Uh, 
<laughs> Run. That was a close one, right, Dorito? Dorit? Dorit? Shit, I lost him. Guess I'm gonna have to go on without him. Eh, well that hole seems pretty unsafe. Well, I'm gonna avoid these cartoon antics and just jump over it. And luckily, there's no elite behind me to knock me out. Hello? I hear you. Where am I? Rev. You, the visions. Do you know why you're having visions, Rev? Vengeance? Every previous owner of that sniper died prematurely. You're alive. I kept you alive by communicating with you. Why? Every person you've met with that weapon who holds vengeance in their heart has or will suffer a consequence. Like my father. Uh, it will kill everyone you know. Then, it will kill you. Put it at its resting place near the orb. Fulfill the prophecy. And let no one touch it again. So the prophecy is real. It does change the fate of the galaxy. It changed the world. It already has. You'll see that for yourself once you leave this temple. I must go. W wait, I have, I have so many, many questions. questions. I must pass on to the afterlife. One, one question, question, please. Yes? Was your game attack XXX Little Run XXX? No! Okay, okay, just, uh, just making sure. Goodbye, and thank you. Ugh. Rev? Rev, is that you? You're Vicky's ex. I told you to stay with my girl. Ah, sounds like you're jealous. I can sense my comrades are fighting a losing battle. I must help them. Stay here and guard the old. It's not going anywhere, dumbass. Brett, oh my gosh, am I fucking happy to see you. Please don't arrest me. Oh, and we came to save you. Dorito and I. Dorito's here? Wow, he did it! He's alive! I never said all that. Oh. But it's the thought that counts. He's a hero. Yeah, that's what I love about Dorito. He may be a pussy sometimes, but he has a good heart. And he loves you. Yeah. That's something I always admired about him. He knows when to take a hit. Yep, he's always taking it like a champ. Bitch. Ow. Bitch. Ow. Bitch. Ow. Hell yeah, you won't hear Dorito cry for mercy. Mercy! Mercy! The sniper is in its original location. It's done. What's done? I fulfilled the prophecy. Explain. Vengeance can consume a man. It drives him to do things he normally wouldn't do. But eventually, the man's hatred backfires on him. Sometimes it turns you into a cold-blooded killer who seeks nothing but revenge. They too suffer. Thankfully, the prophecy taught me that vengeance eats away at the soul. Every person who owned this sniper rifle in the past died. Its legacy. Those who have a chance of redemption from a vengeful soul obtained the sniper rifle as a test. Even though I killed a lot of people, if I hadn't bought this sniper, I wouldn't have learned this lesson in the first place. I was fortunate. My enemies were paid through their own negative actions. You don't expect all your enemies to die that easily, do you? Some people are more tactical than they let on. Maybe, but someone once told me that the fate of the galaxy and the world itself is changing. And I'd see that as soon as I leave the temple. How? We'll find out soon. We'll find out soon. <laughs>